The School of Contemporary Music is a unique school that focuses on the needs of the musician in the 21st century, and there's several ways that we do that. One is that improvisation as a theme and something that pervades all of our programs is really important. Everybody improvises, including our classical musicians. We do a tremendous amount of interdisciplinary practice. Um, we expose the students to different art forms, and we think that that's a really great focus as well. Technology is a really strong focus in our courses too. We're forward thinking, this, okay, what's next? What does technology um, hold for us tomorrow? You know, where is the music going? Where is jazz going? Yeah. Our courses are very focused in terms of skill based. Yeah. Then there's the sort of transferable skills where we train them to be critically minded, to be resilient. Yeah. And of course, as musicians, they need to know how to communicate yeah. Yeah. and they yeah. need to work together as teams. So they're very good transferable skills into the yeah. industry. As they get into graduating years, we give them exposure to the Esplanade and Victoria Concert Hall and larger spaces where they get exposure to the Singapore public. Outside that, we're very active in the region. Every year we often go to places like Thailand, we've been to Malaysia. They start to get an idea of the region and playing within the region because I think that's very important for a musician's career. We have alumni touring and being released on different record labels, Warner for instance and record labels taking them to Japan, they've gone to Europe. On the other hand, as academics, they've gone and yeah. continued their studies and have come back. Yeah. 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 Music, I think, is one of the most reliable careers you could probably do in the arts. Yeah. Often what people see, if they're not a musician or involved in the industry, wow. is either the busker or the Lady Gaga. And it's either one extreme or the other. But actually, 95% of musicians are somewhere in between. So that would mean that they do performing each week, they'll do some teaching each week, and it's a combination of that. That's what musicians have been doing for the last 400 years. Bach, Mozart, Beethoven did the same thing. So we're really continuing that in a much more modern sense.